Yeah, so I had to really look through here to get some garlic that's not moldy. Not moldy, but sometimes I get the black spots on them. I noticed that a lot lately. Like, see this one? You can see it drying out inside. So you have to really check it out, you know? I prefer the bare garlic. It's one that's even healthier. That's much healthier than that. Oh, wow. Here you go. Look. Red lentils, my favorite. I love white beans. Only thing is, some for some reason, where I've been getting beans and stuff lately, they don't cook. I could have this have it on the stove for hours and it still doesn't cook. So I'll be waiting for my pink beans and my navy beans, the um, red beans, all of those delicious things. Here, look, zucchini. It's two ninety nine for this. Mm, that's expensive, isn't it? Two ninety nine. I love zucchini. Zucchini is loaded in zinc. I love it to make soup out of it. One day I'll show you guys a soup recipe for the zucchini. I'm going to see if I can find it loose where I can get a couple of zucchini. But look at all the delicious vegetables. Delicious. Yeah. Um, let me see. Celery, if it's not organic, I try not to get it, but I do enjoy celery. When celery is organic, it is amazing for your body. It helps to make you flexible. So if you're getting older like me, you need all the help that you can get as far as flexibility goes. So here we go. Let's see. I'm going to get some tomatoes. My family likes when I cut them up and just put simple olive oil on it. And um, I'll show you guys that, too. Sometimes when you have people over, it's so nice to just have simple things, simple dishes that are tasty. You allow them to taste the flavors of the food rather than overdoing it. Hmm, pumpkin, really healthy. I'm going to get that because I think I want to make white beans this week. Let me see. Mm, ever have white beans, Puerto Rican style, with, um, with um, pumpkin in it? Oh, my goodness. One of my favorite, favorite ways to have beans. This one is 210. I really don't need a whole lot of pumpkin, so I'm just gonna get that one. That's 210. Yeah. Let me see. I'm looking to see if there's a better looking one than that one. You know, if I get more than that, I tend to waste. This is really good in a soup, too. Okay, so I'm gonna get pumpkin that in the cart. What else? Oh, I love this here. They have the baby romaine lettuce, and they come three, and they are 95. So three for 95. I usually get six, but as of late, there's been a bit of waste in my house when it comes to these things, so I'm just going to get one. I think I have a package at home already. And then a nice bag of onions. I have that, but that's only 50 cents. Okay, well, actually, it equates to 60 cents. Let me see what else. I want to get some cucumbers. This is the avocado. Here we go, some cucumbers. I love Trader Joe's does this, too. They get theirs from England, I think, and they wrap it up like this. I'm going to get two of those. It's two for 150. Got to make sure they're really hard or else they're, they're not good at all. This one's great. And let's see what else. Mm, this one is pretty good. Oh, I snack on these. I'll have to show you guys this as a snack also. <laughs> Cucumbers are supposed to be very good for the hair. I couldn't eat these for a long time. I've just recently been able to eat them again. So let me see. Yeah, that feels good. I'm going to get this. I'm going to get a parsley because I love to juice with parsley. I'm going to get the curly one. The curly one's a lot greener, so I tend to buy that. Will you bag that for me, please? Thank you. There's beets. I wouldn't buy them out in the open like that. But I like to put that on my salad. I'll show you guys that one day. Oh, and look, you guys know I love Swiss chard, right? Look, Swiss chard. Look how big that is. They're like monstrous, you know? Really monstrous. Delicious. 
Let's see what else. Let's look for some good deals here. I am going to buy some salad. Oh, here, these are the peppers. They usually come three together and they're not expensive when they come like that. So I'm going to get that as well. I just have to find it. And here is a salad that I buy. I buy this a lot. I tend to have Swiss chard a lot and one day I'll do a video and explain that. Really not, really everything you have you should do in moderation. So it's just hard sometimes to find a lot of like variety in vegetables. So because of that, I tend to gravitate towards the things that are more available. This one looks good. This is, um, let me see what's in this one. Mosh. This has Swiss chard, spinach, everything in it. So I think that's better to get. It's expensive, but let me see. 119. That's good. Let me get one more bag. 119. Okay. I love salad. There we go. You see that? All the green in there. And it even has arugula. What else? Let me see. Okay. Here's the exotic section. Sweet potatoes. I love sweet potatoes. They're just hot, hard to digest. Ginger. I have lots of that at home. And you guys know how I love to cook with Thai chili peppers. There you go. That I love with fish sauce and on most so many things that I eat. And here's kiwi. I love kiwi. I buy that all the time. Kiwi's loaded in vitamin C. It's an antioxidant. I have a lot of those at home, so I don't think I'll pick up any today. And I will definitely be getting one of these from Ghana. A pineapple. Delicious. I was told that the way to find out if a pineapple is ready is to pull the stem from the inside. And if it comes out easily, that means it's ready. This one didn't, so I'm going to get it because I'm not ready to have it yet within the next few days. So anyway, I just wanted to show you guys the healthy sections of the store the grocery store these limes don't look too happy I'm not going to get that the healthy sections and um, awesome they have platanos over there which we eat in Puerto Rico platanos sugar cane look at that sugar cane alright guys take care good health to you when I get home I'll show you guys what I got okay bye